Hey, what's up guys? Hey, so today I have kind of a rare one. Um, for some reason, two laptops decided to come in today. Or, uh, not today, but basically in the same day. So, um, I was going to go ahead and make a video about it. Um, I've already taken this one apart because I wanted to make sure that the part matched up with the uh, part that I ordered. So I, I didn't want to make a mistake and, and order the wrong one. Um, this one though is, uh, it says model, uh, 15-K253CA, um, and it's a HP, so, um, I just went ahead and, uh, typed in that and found the part and then took apart the laptop and made sure that the picture looked exactly the same as the one that I was buying. So that's probably the best way to do it is to just take it take it off, take it apart real quick because they're not that difficult, most of them. And, uh, and just make sure that your part lines up with uh, the part that you're purchasing. So um, what I did was already I just took these tabs off. There's these um, sticky tabs right here that come off that cover our two screws right here. There's one. Uh, the screws are already out though. One and two. And then once those two screws are out, you can just start snapping this uh, plastic piece off. Make sure I'm still recording here. Okay. You can start snapping the plastic piece off here. And go ahead and start wherever you want to. Um, uh, it's plastic, so you want to be careful, you know. Just take your time. Once you hear that, you know it's starting, so... <clears throat> Just take your time around the edge. And uh, before you do this too, you want to make sure the battery is out of it. Take the battery out before you start. Okay. So I'm just going to work my way around pulling out away from the screen. There's a little bit of adhesive back here, so um, you'll have to get through that. Okay. There we go. It just pops out like that. So once, um, once that's out, we can take out the four screws that are holding this in. They're all black, the black ones here. There's one, two, three, and four. Don't mistake them for those ones on the edge there. You don't need to take those out. Hopefully you can see that. Yes, I think you can see that. So it's going to be one, two, three, and four. And you can always look at your new part too to see exactly where they are. this down like that and then there's just this 40 pin um, plug-in right here that you're gonna unplug and this just slides out like that <clears throat> there's your old part take that out So here's the new part that I got. Um, I just got it from eBay. And uh, it says obviously don't touch there. And um, you wanna be really delicate not to bend it or anything like that because these parts are very delicate. So if you have kind of heavy hands, you might not wanna try this fix. Um, but we're just gonna plug this back in. Make sure you're lined up before you push it in. I want to make sure I'm plugged in real good here. There we go. Right. Okay. 
Okay. So then that's plugged in. I want to, um, I'm going to put some tape over it because, um, j there's nothing s that snaps in that holds it in. So I don't want it to come unplugged. So, let's see if I can reuse this tape. Yeah. I won't use that. I'm going to get some of my own, my own tape here. This is, a. Uh, Captain tape. It uh, repels heat, so this will work fine for just holding it in place. Obviously, you don't want to push too hard on it. Okay. Very complicated fix, I know, right? Four screws. Um, I'm just going to check this right, before I put it back together. Checking to make sure my screw is tight there. So there's a couple um, plastic little uh, probes that um, you kind of line up with. You line up. Uh, once the part's lined up, then you can start screwing it in, which is what I'm going to do. I'm just going to put the top two ones in and then I'm going to turn it on just to make sure it works. Okay. Actually, I'm going to put in all four because I need to fold this down in order to put the battery in. So, scratch that. These are kind of heavier screws, so my magnet doesn't want to hold on to it, my screwdriver. Okay, there's all four screws in, I'm going to fold it down. And hopefully there's enough charge on this. Truth. Yep, cool. Cool, cool, cool. All right, so just making sure everything looks good. I'm gonna wait for it to kind of half boot up here and then I'll shut it down.
I just noticed my wire is sticking out here. I might have to take out these screws and kind of put it back in place. There's like two little tabs here that <clears throat> your wire has to go above. There's one tab there, and you can't see the other one, but it's right there. So. Okay. Well, at least we know it works. I'm not... I'm not sure what happened to this to make it broken, but um, looks like they're going to have to go through and um, go through and figure out um, this troubleshooting thing. So, um, all right, so I'm going to go ahead and just take this back off. Tuck that wire in. Okay. Okay, there we go. So yeah, you see those two tabs right there? Your wire kind of needs to be underneath the screen and on top of those two tabs. So, put my screws back in and then we can snap that plastic piece back on. to put the uh, the hooks in first at the bottom here. And then, there we go. Once it starts, then it's a little easier to finish up. What I should have done is uh, put that adhesive back on, some sticky adhesive underneath there. Just want to make sure it's all the way snapped on. There we go. Last little snap. Oh, there we go. I'm just being really gentle down here because it said do not touch, so I don't want to force it too hard down there. Alright, so yeah, I'm just folding it over and kind of seeing to make sure my plastic piece is lined up. Looks pretty good. <clears throat> Just test it one more time. Okay, I'm gonna, while this um, boots up, looks good, um, I'm gonna take these sticky tabs off and put my screws back in. And then put the tabs back over it. Look at that, this time it's gonna work. There we go. 
All right, other screw in, and it should finalize the fix. Oops. There we go. Oh, look, it's Orlando Bloom on the screen. Right there. That's how he talks. Okay. There we go. We are good to go, people. Cool, cool. I'm glad that this works. All right. So, hopefully that helps you guys out. Um, if not, if you didn't like the video, uh, I don't really care. You can go to hell. Um, but if you did like the video, then you can give it a thumbs up, buddy. Okay. Um, sorry about that. That was a little, a little dark of me, but you know, I'm just tired of the haters. All right, you guys have a good one.